Welcome to North of the Broad. With us now is Lee Copeland. She is the Assistant Vice President of Marketing for the Technical College of the Low Country. Lee, a lot going on. Welcome. Absolutely. So let's get right to it. How's how's it going this semester? I think you're hybrid. You've got online. You've got students actually coming in. But you you said earlier it's going fairly well. It's going well. You know, I mean, it's it's been quite the year for us all. I think. Yes. And. Um, I guess it's been almost seven months now since the, the COVID pandemic began, but I think the college has really stepped up. Um, we just met the challenges head on and have, have continued to go on. Our students have just persevered and just been so flexible. So we are um, right now still doing a majority of the classes online. Okay. However, we do have some of those hands-on classes, those technical education classes that are still meeting in person so they can get that experience. So some of our health sciences labs, mm -hmm. um, our building construction, HVAC labs, those are ongoing in, in the classroom. We were talking earlier about the importance of a technical college education, a community college, a two-year degree, the certificates that you can get, the accreditations. I mean, I and I've taught in actually Greenville Tech for 16 years, so I firm believer mm -hmm. in our technical college uh, situation and uh, system here in in South Carolina. So, I want to hear your your version, your sure. kind of guess. So, why do you think it's so important for the two-year? Well, we all, you know, all of us need an HVAC repairman from right. time to time. I mean, having a technical skill is so important um, because it, it's what keeps us working. It's what keeps us functioning. These are the careers that, you know, we appreciate and we experience in our daily lives. When you go to a restaurant, um, that chef that's preparing your meal, you want them to be highly trained and, and competent knowing what they're doing. So I think it just affects our facet of every facet of our lives. Um, it really enhances our own living experiences when we have trained trained people in our area. A strong workforce makes a strong community. Right, and a lot of these um, careers are, uh, can, the pay is, is quite good. So Absolutely. I mean, with a two year mm -hmm. certificate or associate's degree. So I mean, it's not like, huh? And that's what I think is so important to understand. You know, we all want, um, I think about this a lot for my own children, you know, doctors and lawyers and all of that. But the reality is that a lot of these careers are really good paying jobs um, with good benefits. Um, they can inspire entrepreneurship, which is really popular with the millennials and the generations coming. You know, they want to be their own bosses. And a lot of these careers, you can do that and, and create your own businesses to serve, to serve right. others. And of course, you have the bridge program if someone wants to go on to the four years. So it's, you make it easy. Absolutely, yes. Right. Let's talk about tuition. So I, I, I think I'm reading this right. Free tuition for the spring? It's so. real, I promise. <laughs> so, but it's how? actually, I know, it's coming down from the state of South Carolina. Right. The state of South Carolina is investing in workforce training. So critical workforce areas have been identified. So these are areas where we know we're looking at some shortages of trained um, workers. So it's anything from health sciences to some of the trades I've already mentioned, building yes. construction, um, computers. Computers is a huge one. Right. Um, on over to our culinary arts mm -hmm. um, and criminal justice programs. All of those sorts of programs qualify for the SC Win Scholarship. And that's gonna pay a student's tuition full time at TCL. Um, and so it also includes a couple hundred dollars toward books, which is really unique. Not a lot of these sorts of scholarships include that. So it really makes college attainable for anyone who wants it. And do you all work with the students once they graduate to get jobs and Abs stay local? Absolutely. And, and again, this goes back to being a community college. Our curriculum is built around what the community needs. Right. So we, um, you know, we always uh, involve business people, um, an area um, industry in the development of our programs to make sure that they are meeting mm -hmm. the needs of that industry. So, you know, they're first in line when we, we get our graduates, they're, they're hiring <laughs> them as soon as we can graduate them. Have you learned, has the college learned um, any lessons through this whole pandemic um, that will, you know, will 
continue your to be successful in the future? Well, I think if anything, it underscores the importance of having that trade or that skill, something that you can fall back on, that no matter what's happening in the economy, you have something to give back to the community. So if anything, I think it's underscored that importance and, and kind of made our, our marketing job a little bit easier and just the value. Yes. You know, lots of people don't have twenty, thirty, forty thousand dollars a year anymore for college. Mm -hmm. um, like mm -hmm. you said, you can right. come to TCL and really get a great career or knock out your first two years and then transfer and then when transfer. you're ready. ready. And so if someone wants to uh, be a student, what? how do you apply? Very simply, go online to tcl.edu. You can uh, submit your online application and we'll have um, one of our admissions people will follow up with you directly and walk you through the process. There's financial aid you'll need to apply for. And then just schedule you know, schedule your classes for spring, which we're doing now. And those classes start in January. They start in January. Great, Lee Copeland. Thank you so much for being with us again. And that's Lee. She is with the Technical College of the Low Country. She's the Assistant Vice President of Marketing. So good job, and we'll talk to you again. Thanks, awesome. Lee. Thank you. Okay. And we'll be right back.